A chilly morning awakens the shrimp capital of Alabama, Bayou La Batra. We have uh, several shipyards, well we did have before the hurricane, we've got a couple left now. Alice Harris and her husband Jimmy operate a shrimp boat they built by hand in their backyard, the Seaweed 2000. All the boats around our boats washed up, up on the ground, some of them totally destroyed. Uh, most of them are still on ground, they're trying to get off in uh, our boat. It was fine, just like we left it. The Harrises are not alone. The town was swallowed whole when Katrina forced as much as 30 feet of water inland. Only one home was left livable after the storm. And we had water white capping in the yard. We had fish and shrimp jumping. Uh, we had to duck to get under power lines when the boats took us. Volunteers of America, a faith-based organization, was thrust into the relief effort and is leading the rebuilding effort in Biolavatra. We get a lot of uh, different college groups, especially for spring break. I mean, we had over 100 volunteers here last week. A group of six Winthrop students spent their spring break helping the community and residents in need. Work included cleanup, painting, deck building, and other finish work. Well, I mean, all I've done is paint, but I just feel like it helps them to know that there is someone that will help them and that they're not alone and that people are willing to give up things for other people. The students finished repairing one home for an elderly man to move back into within the next week. Every home painted and every wall installed brings the town one small step closer to the normal life before Katrina. Okay, it's a very slow process. There's so many homes that was destroyed. So, but nah, it will get back. It's just going to take the time.